dust and for your touch and the way you move you hypnotize me with your lips you've got me losing control waiting on you to make your move it's all on you baby to make your move it's all on Let me talk to you. Hey, we're back. We're back after five days of not doing this. We're back. How are we doing? How are we doing? All right. Since this is day twenty, I think we're gonna have the uh, time travel gimmick, probably. So let's make some uh, no light. I think that's the 39. Should be fine. I need you to come oh, here this instant. I'm at HQ. Oh. You better be here soon, or there will be Next consequences. Kozlov's going to sacrifice me. They left me here, and he is coming after yeah. me as well. We both know who I'm talking about. I can't trust Kozlov anymore. Oh. You have to help me finish what we started. You and me. Started. We're in this together until the end. Whether you like it or not, you wouldn't want him to find out the truth, would you? 
I mean, he probably knows the truth. I'm waiting right? in Lenin Square. Make haste, or we're both going to regret it. I guess I really am naive, huh? huh. I think you owe me an explanation, old friend. Cool. Are you prepared to face the day's challenges? Yes. Alright, nothing. Nothing, nothing, nothing. Tools are quite three out of five. Wait. What other tool did I get? Eh, who cares? We're good. Oh, it's not today. Okay. Ah, <sighs> boyo. E nothing. Uh. Food and you. Let's do it. Looks like your mentor sold you out. Or perhaps yep. he was involved in all of this from the beginning. Regardless, he's clearly no longer your friend. He set a trap for you, Igor. What are you going to do about it? Kill them all. <laughs> Kill them all, buddy. Kill them all. And load it. Nice. Pripyat Central. Foot five. Okay. Who this? Oh yeah, I got the AK. Hey, it's Evgeny. Stop right there. You're on Pripyat Broad for term now. You mentioned something about trade. What kind of things do you have? What about this uh, box, box of loot? loot? That'll be one food ration. Sure yes. thing. Nice. There you go. It's just for you. Yeah. I better be going now. Broadfall forever, Igor. Broadfall forever. All right, box of loot. You here, you here, and you. Let's open it up. Oh no. 12 herbs! Awesome, that's super good. It's actually really good. Alright, either over there or behind the building. Don't care either way. We're going in. Yeah! Hmm. Oh, gosh. Dog, shoot. Hmm, no chemicals. Hmm. Eh, I need this. I. Whoa. Uh -oh. Doesn't sound good. Doesn't sound good at all. Oh, it's a heavy. Oh, no. Can't do it. Oh, I can. Okay. <laughs> Check him out, son. Pretty damn good. Two of them. This is so fucking surreal. Those things can go through walls. I saw it with my own eyes. I hate being outside. But this one is trapped oh, in a simple wet. cage. I like how the other guy doesn't even notice. Oh, he didn't notice now. Eh, it's fine. No ceramic plate. Hmm. No mechanical parts. Oh boy. Alright. Food ration. Drop you. 
I fly more quickly. I can't drop nothing. I'll just let you go then. Uh, this whole area? Oh no. Sucks, dude. Go. Oh, two of them. One last sweep and I'm done. Alright. Wow, that does piss poor damage. Look at this. How am I behind cover? I wasn't even behind cover, dude. Nice level. Up. Keramic plate. Oh, I do need that. Come on, fill up. Oh no, it's a bat. Oh, I need batteries for that. Okay, I'm gonna use the. Demo. Which means I can get the other one. What do we got, buddy? And you. And you. Nice. Good. Good, 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 good. Wait, my sack is going down the toilet. Whoa. Chug it up. Nice. Nothing in here. Huh. Where are you at? Semenov. Oh. Not here, I guess. Seminole, Seminole, where are you at? Everyone thought he was just some nutty professor. He blindsided us all. He gets figured out how to disable the technology he uses to make jobs. The stupid thing was heavy as shit. We had to carry it on our backs to set up the ambush. It was all for nothing. The fucker escaped anyway. Between this guy and those fucking monsters, I'm starting to think I should polish up my resume. <laughs> He's still talking about choked out. What the heck? What do you mean, game? What do you mean? Nice. Well, man, it's fine. So, where the heck is he? Where the heck are you, Seminoff? In which tent? He pops, nice. Up there? Can be. No way. Uh oh, that lighting doesn't uh, look good. Cat like. Hmm. Is 
what the heck is he? Neo. 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 Ooh. Disgusting looking bag. Oh, there we go. Before you jump to any conclusions, Oof. I can explain. Holy cow. Okay. Look Start at his talking. face, damn. Not here. Let's go someplace where we can talk privately. <laughs> no thanks. I'm not falling for that again. You're confused, my boy. Disturbed. The Chernobylite is messing with your head, but I can help you. No, can you really? The way you helped me on the hospital roof? Just... Oof. God, please don't do anything rash. Okay, then. Ask your questions. Yes. What's NAR's interest in Chernobylite? Their interest is in a potentially trillion... Trillion? I trust I don't need to explain the possibilities of a nearly unlimited energy source. I don't care about that. They're keeping Tatiana here against her will, aren't they? Why? Where is she? Tatiana is a patient. A very valuable one. That's what's keeping her safe. At least for the time She's being. She's here then. NAR That's good. has done some despicable things, I give you that. They've conducted some questionable experiments on human subjects. But Tanya is different. She's special. Like Special Olympics special? I researched Chernobylite myself. It has many potential applications. Hmm. What are you and your NAR overlords planning to do with it? I know you did. You wouldn't be here if you didn't. The catastrophe of 1986 was a great gift for gift. humanity. One of the greatest. Okay. What are you talking about? Chernobylite opened the door to something that will change the Hey, Mr. Clean, of how are you doing forever. today? Forever. Energy forever. capable of creating a singularity, multiple singularities, and tunnels between them. More than that, it gives us access to the ones already in existence. Oh. It's like an autonomous vehicle that can take you anywhere in time and space, complete with maps. The first maps. such route is already in place. We just need to make sure it's safe. Tatiana. Tatiana Amelieva. You acted like you had no idea what happened to her. But she's been here this whole time, hasn't she? Yes. I cannot deny it. But please, you don't know all the facts. Well, tell me then, dude. in heaven. Is there not a single shred of decency left in you? I could tell you things that would turn your whole life upside down. Huh. But I don't I'm not going to that. fill you, no way. I can't have you falling apart. Don't you understand? I need you. What are you saying? Good. I need you here. You're going to help me save her. Oh. I will ask you one last time. Where is Tatiana? Igor, please. Listen to reason. Do you want to learn about your personal threshold for pain? I said talk! All right, all right. But it's still Kozlov's fault. You have to believe me. Tanya is in the power plant, I swear it. Power plant? I was Kozlov there! Is keeping her there. Thanks, Listen to once. me, Igor. This is important. You understand that what I'm trying to accomplish here is bigger than you or me. Shut your goddamn mouth! I ah. can't listen to any more of your excuses. You can't leave him alive, Mousy. He will thwart our plan. He will bring about the end of the world and the reign of the Rat King. Don't do anything you'll regret later, Igor. You're better than them. Mm. Remember that. More practically speaking, you might need the old bastard later. Think spare. I know the safest thing to do is to kill you. But I'm leaving you alive, against my better judgment. Thank you. You won't regret this, Igor. Oh, that remains to be seen. We will talk again. And when we do, I expect your full cooperation. Absolutely. 
Go find Tatiana in the power plant. After we so talk. Black Stalker is gonna be in the power plant. For sure. Finally, some definitive proof. Tatiana is at the power plant. Ready for the final phase. More move patient hero to the power plant so we can start the communion. Hold on. As soon as all elements are in place, use the acid or staff to dispose to expedite the process. Maven needs to be prepared. Uh oh, as soon as possible. So drop whatever you're doing and get to it. Of course, love and or Cropat can give you any trouble, just send them away. <laughs> Summon off. By the way, get rid of this idiot Alosha before he damages my work and I throw you both of the shadows. Okay. Oh! Uh oh. Yeah, I'm out of here, dude. Hmm. No, 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 I'm out. I'm out. I do not that thunder one bit. One bit. Nice, everyone succeeded. Can I play it? Nice. Alright. You, 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 you. On the ground. Okay, what's on the ground? Revolver. 14 revolver ammo. Ay, ay, ay. Ask for the one. Did yes sound right? Yes, it is. Well, it was before, so. Oh no. Wait, what? It was on. I did not turn it off. I did not turn it off. But thank you for the bits. <laughs> Scam. <laughs> it was on. You know it was on, it was on last time. So no way it should be off. Mm, yeah. <laughs> Scammed, yeah. <laughs> I got saved. <laughs> oh boy. Oh. Battery. Yeah, you got scammed, buddy. Don't blame me. Don't blame me. TTS probably doesn't recognize the uh, what the heck are those? Worked in uh, the channel. Oh, well. told you, don't blame me. Not a watch. Yeah, right. Good enough, mine. We got nine. Nine batteries. Damn, I don't like it full though. Hmm. I think I can survive without. Oh. Hmm. Okay, there we go. One up. And. No, not you. You. You here, you here. Plate. You. Watch. 
and did it smoke vaginas? <laughs> you lie. I know you lie. Mm. Yeah, good enough, I think. Split this. Okay, good enough, I guess. What's going on, Igor? No one talk? Nope. Does anyone want to talk? No. I can see things, Nancy. Ooh. Are you okay? You don't look so hot. The terror courses through me. Present, past, future. A tormented, hungry beast about to burst free of its cage. Uh -oh. A volcano of unstoppable force. Hellish green light and poisonous vapors. Is this in the past or the future? Future? Past? These distinctions mm. are meaningless before a terror from out of this world. We awoke something that night in 1986. Something so alien. It is almost so beyond alien. our comprehension. Beyond comprehension? I don't think so. We'll get to the bottom of this eventually. Everything has a scientific explanation. Oh. Remember, Igor. This isn't just some... Stuff for Stuff. you to carry off It's so much more. Do you need to be ready for anything, Mousy? Yes, I probably will. How the fuck do I have no money? It's... Damn. The fuck you want? Mm hmm. Neutral. Yeah, that's fine. Wait, four points. The fuck you want? Mikhail, you've been around gathering. Mm, additional food rations. Sure. Perfect. Let's do it. I like how you stood up when I. What the fuck are we doing here again? No. Oh. oh right. Oh, glad you remembered. Since you're the one who dragged me out into the wilderness. Stood up. Listen talk carefully and just and don't ask questions. Why would don't it? You'll need a eating. Oh, well, that's a no, right? Yeah, yeah. Never so, so Igor. Eat what? Uh, wait. Uh, no, I've been putting together this compendium of herbs. I could have just read this in the whip. <sighs> Never. <laughs> Never mind. <laughs> Is that it? Yes, fate of black. Nice. Perfect. Survival instinct. Uh, we sleep in. Uh, wait. New and. 203, 204. Nice. Soon. Soon. Uh oh, not her again. Rise and shine, Igor. Tatiana. There are things you need to face. Find me in Go so fast, okay. Tatiana. She's gone again. Rip. Okay. That's for me. Food stash. You. Food supply, you. Medicine drop, you. Food drop, you. Hello. Zapped. Actual question marks, okay. That's inside. How to get inside? Here? No. <laughs> nice. Food ration point zero one four oh oh eight. Chibus, dude. Like stingy much game? Point one. Okay, at least it gives me something. Uh huh. Do nothing. 
That's it. Oh no. Them again. Still above. No! Not the doll. Who want the doll? The doll gives me the creeps. Wait. Disappeared. Thanks, I guess. Got nothing. Oh, someone. Wait, nothing here then. Shadow. I shouldn't have host. That's fine. Ah, full inventory, damn it. One eighty one. Then I guess. Oh, I missed a lot of shots. Wait, what? Negative point one? Are you kidding me, game? All right. Give me the chemicals. Give me those chemicals. And I'm going inside. No need. Come on. Where are you appearing, buddy? Can't escape from me. Oh sh! How did he appear? What the heck? Oof. Ooh. Okay. You got me, buddy. You got me. No, mm. damn you, doll. Is that it? No reward. Come on. Nope. All right, let's go to the main objective then. I can hear stuff. There's probably Chernobylite in there somewhere. Or not. Eh, it's fine. It's fine. Just come on through. We're good. Ooh, okay. Not good, not good, not good. There we go. Just two though. Hmm. What? Up. Nice. Food ration. Can I pick it up? 
Thank you. The worst part, I was here before. Like, uh, actually, met her. Pencil. Pripyat Secondary School number three. The biggest of the five. My friend Nadia's daughter used to go here. I remember. They had an outstanding program. Art, languages, and most importantly... Science? Beans. Naturally. I bet you can still find a portrait of Lomonosov or Newton hanging up there. Cute. Probably not. But that's not all they taught us at this school, is it? What are you getting at? Propaganda speeches, military drills, preparing little kids for World War III. Yeah. What do you do when the evil capitalists drop an atomic bomb on your house, duck and cover? No. no. You put on your gas mask and marching boots, grab a rifle and rush the enemy. You kill it. You crush it. You annihilate it. Ooh. Even when you die, you're not free. So when the party commands it, you rise <laughs> up from the dead to fight it again. Nice. And most of all, you keep your mouth shut. All your life, you protect the state secrets. Then you take them to your grave. Yes. Those were different times. The Cold War mentality and us versus them routine. What Not has changed? Really different. But has it? Really? Yes, it has. We live in a new world now. Look around you. How is this new world working out for you? These children. They were raised to fight the enemy. Fight how the do you fight an invisible enemy? You can't see it. You can't taste it. Taste Yet, it. You can feel how it penetrates your body. Corrupts you from the inside. Kinky. And you, Igor? Who are you fighting against? Everyone and everything that stands between me and you, Tanya. And what if you're wrong? What if the enemy is you? <gasps> well, what are you saying? Time Imagine. to move, Igor. We're done here. Right, on to the next one then. Down we go. Bop. Hmm, five. Inside there, okay. Can we jump this? No. Not accessible. The pool. Cup. Ooh. Winner. The Azure swimming pool. It brings back so many memories. Tatiana Fomina Amelieva. Youngest freestyle champion swimmer in Pripyat. You know. I sometimes think you Why do I hear water? It would have been best if you'd pursued a career in sport. <laughs> Give me a break. I was never going to be another Galina Prozumenshikova. I never would have won any Olympic gold Imagine uh, medals. pronouncing that. For me, name. it was always about this feeling of freedom. Being able to float and become weightless. That was my refuge. Swimming. Yes. You always wanted to teach our... I uh, mean... Say it. Children. I, I can't. Do you think you would have made a good father, Igor? Yes. I don't know. You tell me. Huh. How do you know I'm not just a voice in your head, my love? There are things you need to figure out by yourself. Unfortunately, I can't help you. Oof. Okay. All right. Yes. I think I'd make a good father. I would do everything, everything, to protect our child. Is that to all keep fathers? Him or her from drowning. Like you kept me from drowning? That's not fair. Why? Why are you doing this? I'm not doing anything, my love. You're doing it to yourself. Mental Come going eager. down the gutter. We still have one more place to visit. Uh oh. Bop.
Dude, radiation, 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 radiation. Muscle throw it. Muscle throw it. Okay. We're good. And you. Not inside a building in it. Oh man. Like I was just here, dude. Hello. Ooh, container. Two Chernobylite. Awesome. Two Chernobylite. Four total. Awesome. Super good. Picture. Yeah. Nice. Remember this place? Oh, this is... It's our old apartment. How could I have forgotten it? Perhaps you wanted to forget. Perhaps you needed to forget, Igor. It used to be our past and future, both. But it's just an empty shell now. Look at this apartment. What happened to all our 500 time? bucks. For my him. desk, my books, your violin. Who knows? It's all gone now. Stolen, ruined, torn apart. It must have been extremely irradiated. It would all be worthless anyway. True. The liquidators probably removed it all. They had to bury it. Or perhaps some low-life smugglers took it. People are so predictable. They'll snatch up whatever they can carry if the opportunity arises. Yes. I once heard a story about a guy who stole a window because... I don't care about any stupid windows, and neither do you. You're only trying to distract yourself with those pointless little antidotes. From what? From what From you should have faced the minute you came back to the zone. Instead, mm. you chose to run around like a cowboy and fight a bunch of mercenaries and unravel the secrets of Chernobylite. When it's been right here all this time, wow, thanks, staring Tatiana. you in oh, your yeah, yeah. face, the truth about us. It's just an empty apartment, Tanya. It's the truth. Nice. All right, we're done here. We are done here. And... And... Nice. We're back. I need double. And yeah, we're good. I didn't even heal. Come on, game. Igor, I need to talk to you. Um, <coughs> Mousy today. So the Rat King is gone? No. It won't be long before it returns. We don't have much time. You need to help me. I need to find out what happened to me. I remember the explosion. Were you close to reactor number four? That was the night Tachana disappeared. What do you remember? Not much. Fire, sirens waving, burned men, agonized screaming. Agonized. Probably doesn't even... Uh, in 1972. What? Explain it. I think you've got the time and geography mixed up. The KGB and some military geniuses tried to put out a fire in the natural gas mine with a nuclear device. Whoa. Almost a kiloton yield. It blew everything up, the morons. The column of fire and radioactive ash kilometers high. People in villages nearby thought it was the end of the world. What were you doing there? I don't know. I'm trying to remember, but I can't. All I know is I was there to observe. Well, calm down, Tarakan. We'll get to the bottom of it eventually. Try to get some rest now. All right? All right. Bad. Uh oh, that's not good. Hey there. Tarakan. But of course I can't. Yeah, I Actually, I can't. 
Alright. Anyone else wants to talk to me? The fuck you want? Nope. <laughs> First aid kit, nothing. Lockpicks, it's fine. Oh, that's a big yield. Look at that. Split. Give me four. You and that's it. Yeah. Yeah. That's full. Full, full, I mean. Wait, I don't need you. I don't need, don't need you. Bop. And bop. You, you, and you. Yeah, it's good. Oh, good. There you go. Six spots. There you go. Nothing. What's going on, Eagle? Shut up and take my money! Jesus Christ, robot. Oh boy, that scared the <clears throat> crap out of me. Whoo. Oh, welcome in, buddy. Whoo. Oh boy. <laughs> Damn it. I should lower the sounds of those. Holy cow. Oh. <sighs> Alright, I'm good. I'm good. <laughs> I have nothing here, so I mean, someone's gonna call me. No. Igor! Igor! I'm gonna Hail. talk to you! Some serious shit is about to go down! What is it this time? I don't think you look 10 years younger. No way. We have a chance to intercept him. We have to act on this intel now. Who is this big fish anyway? No idea. But it's got to be one of NAR's top people. A real 100,000 ruble suit type. Rubles? <laughs> That's not much to go on. Could just be a waste of time. It is uh, not 10 years, but, worth a yeah. shot. Imagine what kind Shaved. of we can squeeze out Time for a change, guy. eh? Just go over there and check it out for yourself, okay? I know a good vantage point. All right. But let's make one thing clear first. I'll do the talking. I've got a feeling this big fish might not survive your squeezing. Sure, sure. Whatever you say, boss. I'll mark the location on your map. Nice. Binoculars. Big fish. It's for me. Ammo drop, that's for you. Monster. Oh no, that's for a monster hunt. One, two, three, four, five. Wait, who doesn't have a mission? Mikhail does not have one. Okay. Send three. Mm. Okay, good enough, good enough, good enough. You mean next generation? <laughs> you and your internal jokes. Nothing is ever as it seems with Mikhail, is it? What is he dragging you into this time? The NAR fish tank is a very murky and dirty place. Dirty. Can you really tell the difference between a big fish and a bottom feeder when you meet them? Yes, how they dressed, I guess. But since everyone's dressed equally in radiation suits, And Chernobylite FC. <laughs> Alright, any points of interest? No. No, oh, that's a sign. Okay. 250 though. Alright, straight towards him. Hmm, radiation. Oh! Three guys, do I kill him or not? Uh, 
You just choke them all. Kill them all. Nah, I'll try to choke them out. Don't want to waste my psyche. Wait, where a gun? There a gun. Oh, that one's coming towards us. <laughs> Move it along, loser. Hello. Damn it, son. Oh, I missed. I missed. Imagine that. We're gone. They're gone. Mechanical parts. Uh, can I drop anything? Rifle ammo. That went well. Only missed once. Hmm. Uh oh, I heard something. Oh yeah, I have cat. We. I'm a cot. That means cat. I'm in position. How is this a good vantage point? No tower? No hill? Uh, right. Uh, you all need a tower. There should be a control unit nearby. Find yes. it and power it up. Cool. Oh. Something. Computer processing. Whoa. Whoa. Found it. Are you kidding me? What is this thing? Mikhail, what are you not telling me? And where is this big fish? He'll be flying over in a helicopter pretty soon. All you need to do is fire up the missile defense system. The rest is automated. Pretty fucking awesome, right? It's old Soviet technology. I found it totally by chance. Don't tell me that's not a great fucking plan. What? You want me to shoot down a helicopter? Are you out of your goddamn mind? Oh, contraire, mon frere. Ha. It's the perfectly French rational nice. thing to do. Cut off as many of the Hydra's heads as you can! This is insane, Igor. You've no idea who's on board. I know we want to take down NAR, but blowing unidentified targets out of the sky is a war crime. Mm. Sure, come this do far. Let's do it. Come back down now. Hitting NAR like this will keep them off balance. Distracted. It'll buy me some more time. Shut up, son. Think of it as Uncle Mikhail's right up passage. <laughs> right Do it. Passage, okay. Bop. Whoa. No flares, I guess. Boom. Jeebus. But worse, good, and uh, got better, good. Eh, it's fine then. You did it, man! I knew you had that killer instinct! My little executioner! Are you kidding me? I'm so fucking proud of you, Igor! Now, go check the crash site for survivors! Spawns right in front of me. Oh, me. Over here! Seminar! It's Gyogi! Can't breathe! And my legs! Please, find some medical supplies! Help me! We have to get you out of here. No. You go. Hmm. A search team will be here any minute. Though, they might kill you. Who cares? Alright. Are you sure? No. Alright. We're done here, I guess. Out of here. It's seven off, so who cares?
could have waited for the team if it ever came. You... you fucking tricked me! Well, <laughs> now look at you, pretending to be angry. We did great work today, you and I. This is something you won't ever forget. Oof. Why did you want Semenov dead? I didn't. I thought it was going to be Kozlov. He's <laughs> at the top of my list. How did you know about the air defense system? This was a top oh, secret boy. installation, after all. It only makes sense they had a way to counter American spy planes. No more secrets. What did NAR do to you? Why do you hate them so much? Kozlov and his henchmen tore this place apart. They expected everyone to fall in line. They rounded up me and my buddies, tortured us, and shot the others through the head, Ooh. point blank. Me, they left alive to send a Oh message. yeah, it's all about the... What was it? Something five. Well, where do we go from here, Igor? I know we have our differences, but you really ought to stay. I need you here. Damn right you do. Don't you ever forget that. Oof. Okay. Good enough, I guess. Chernobyl, yeah. Double. And yeah, good enough. Good enough. Metal plate. Huh. Healing salary, yes. Wait, I don't need either of those. Well, gotta go. My lunch is almost over. Have a nice stream. Glad I could see you. <laughs> well, uh, have a good rest of your day, buddy. And uh, I'll get you next time. What's going on, Igor? I promise you. <laughs> I swear by it. Yeah. I can hear his voice again, Mousy. He whispers. The Rat King is talking to you. I wouldn't call it talking necessarily. It's more like a feeling of impending doom. Terror. It's always there. Rustling about in the shadows. Still can't believe I got scared by that. I can feel its gaze. By Philip J. Five all people. Inhuman. Infernal. Like. Something from the void. Who is the Rat King? Bet you ask what is the Rat King? Its mind is beyond the comprehension. No one asks how is the Rat King. But surely I can do something to help. You are helping, Mousy. Yes, of course you are helping. You are my right hand in the struggle against Rat King's forces. Forces. And the final battle will be mine. Mine. And mine mine alone. alone. Why? As the poet said, the best laid plans of mice and men often go to shit. Ha! I see. And I'm the mouse in this quote. Why wouldn't you be, Mousy? Bruh. Wee, Sashko. Sup, Igor. Sup. I'm okay. What's on your mind? Exploring Pripyat sometimes reminds me of my life in Moscow. When I was a teenager, that thinning I used to live in one of those awful cheap flats called Khrushchevka. I remember that. I used to live in one as well. They were the epitome of communist architecture. You mean like this right. one? Small, narrow and claustrophobic. Like a cage made of concrete. A scientist might say its size was inversely proportional to how much the family members <laughs> hated each Probably. other. Probably. And somehow it seemed to shrink every year. There was this urban legend going round about the front door being too narrow to fit a coffin through. I never heard that one. So, it was better not to die inside. I think I've heard that somewhere. Me? I wonder all the time what really happened to my parents. I never even went to their funeral. I had to run. But that's a story for another day, I guess. I'm really sorry about your parents, Sashko. All right. Hey, Sa about what? I can show you. Hmm, okay. Actually, okay. I can't. And the fuck you want? Nothing. Okay. All right. Another day, another dollar, I guess. What's going on, Igor? I should get some meds. Full. Oh yeah, yeah. All right. 
you, 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 and give me some first aid kits. Nice. Plus six psyche though. Ooh. Better save the alcohol then. From when I really need it. Yes. Nothing. Okay. Wait, I found a clue, but it wasn't it. Okay. We need to talk, Igor. Ooh. I'm all ears. Got some intel that needs acting on. NAR is preparing a huge shipment of munitions, maybe food as well. We Ooh. can't let this opportunity go. Oh, well, you're not wasting any time on that radio, huh? Sure. I'll look into it. Okay. Weapon transport. Food. You go. Whoa. That worked. Nice. Two, f oh, four. Uh, wait. Um, Kyle. There you go. There we go. Olivier wants to play soldiers, Igor. For him, everything is war, and the spoils of war. What about you, my darling? What is your mission? The it's NAR you. doesn't care about anything or anyone. Deaths are just numbers on a page for that greedy corporate beast. And the beast won't allow you to pull out its teeth so easily. What if I kill it first? What if I kill it first? All right, same place. Ooh, oh no, it's just two guys. Okay. You're kidding me. Damn, Dustin. Through the forest. Spawn. No blight, nice. Oh boy, I'm ready. Uh, yes. There we go. Wait, rifle arm, wasn't that mine? That I dropped the other day? Wait, that's it? Olivier, oh. I'm up on the roof. There's a signal flare in the distance. I assume it's red? Yes. Must be the drop zone. How do I know? That's your target. Time to roll. Good luck. Yes, sir, Olivier, sir. Huh. <laughs> Anton was a good guy. So let's do our best. For him. Try to keep a low profile out there. Don't let NAR spot you. And don't take more than you can easily carry. Heck no. Can't promise that. Whoop. Not like I'm gonna go guns blazing, but I will. Oh boy. Oh boy. Really, a dust in here. Hey, give me my drop. 
Oh, I've been cheated. Ay, ay, ay. Oh well. Three dots, okay. Four dots, uh oh. I think I can sneak this. Looks like Kozlo really pulled some strings this time. Didn't see me, 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 didn't see me. Go away, go away. <laughs> go away, buddy. It's nothing. Absolutely nothing. Olivier, I can see the crates. It looks <laughs> promising. Well done. I know you worked hard for this, but don't get greedy. Remember, low profile. Don't Can't listen promise. to that soldier boy. Fuck low profile. Remember the pointers I gave you, Igor. Be a pro. Igor, any ammo you leave behind, they're gonna use to shoot you in the ass. Blow that shit sky high. Olivier's right. Causing an uproar when it's not completely necessary won't help our mission. I like how no one can see me. Open, open, open. Open. What did I pick up? Alright, out of here. Good. Sneaky it worked. Kinda. Food right? Oh, seven food rations and one med kit. Awesome. Okay, good enough. Um, South Uh, Psyche new. No. Okay, good enough. The fuck you want? Bruh. Neutral, that's fine. Neutral's good. Nope. Alright, you, 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 and you. That's it, that's it. I can't take it anymore! I don't want to! The torture! The suffering! What's happening? Is it a vision? I see a woman! A young woman! She's in so much pain! What? The rats got to her! They tied her to a tree! They're no. eating her alive! No! I can't watch! They're cutting into her! Yeah. They're gnawing on her flesh, lapping up her blood. That's not good. What are you babbling about? You're not making any sense. Oh, they are so, so hungry, these rats. Oh, you cannot believe what hunger will drive a living being to do. The Gulag and the Xeno Island. 
thousands of little city mice sent on a voyage to hell. Ooh. My father was there. It's open up. It rings a bell, but wasn't that before the war? Makes no difference, Mousy. Past, present, future. All are the same in the eyes of the Rat King. Oh, that's awful. I'm sorry about your father. Yikes. Three meals are all that separate us from the rats, Igor. Crazed with hunger. Oh, you and your damned rats. <laughs> no, you bad. Oh, hey man. there, Tarakat. But of course I can. Mm, yes. Fantastic. Cheaper. I'm ready to learn. As you've already noticed, Mousy, resources are scarce in the zone. It's essential to conserve materials when crafting. Of course. You see, Mousy, any damn fool can make soup. Throw a bunch of shit in a pan, add water, turn on the heat, and hope for the best. <laughs> but the True. secret lies in learning the correct proportion of ingredients, and not just in meals. This applies to crafting in general. I'll show you how it's done. But first, you'll need to find two flammable and one mechanical ingredients. Okay. I hid them nearby, so keep your little mouse eyes open. We don't have all day, Mousy. Hurry it up. Really? Anything else? New. <laughs> Come here and use the electric lathe. I'll show you how it's done. Knowledge is everything. You need to understand oh, hello. what every ingredient more. does in order to get the most use out of your material. Material she wanted. Point nine, nice. Well done. Oh, you're a difficult student in spite of all your PhDs, but I'll turn you into a survivalist mousy yet. Huh. Thanks, I guess. Mm. You make me proud, Igor. Under my guidance, you will become the ultimate rat exterminator. What's going on, Igor? Nothing. Alright, I need a... Uh... How are things, Professor? I need more of you. <laughs> nice. Alright, off to bed then, I guess. Two and two. Mm. Give me something already. Oh, her again. Oh, boy. Oh. Wake up, Igor. Tanya, what's going on? I want you to see something. Can't you just tell me? Kupachi, I'll be waiting for you, my love. Ay, ay, ay. Medicine, you. Food drop, you. Medicine, you, and food, you. That's it. That's it. Let's go. Actual two points of interest. Nice. Box of items. It's a uh, Zygmunt Freud book. Uh, uh, 
and know the other one. Remember when we first arrived in this city of the chosen ones? Semenov so badly wanted you on his team. You were handpicked from Leningrad Polytechnic. You and Boris. And you, Tanya. Please, stop lying to yourself. I was only invited here because of you. This was your adventure all along. You were the hero who was supposed to make a difference. We both wanted this. True. You wanted this. But have you ever asked oh, what on. I wanted? Tanya, please. Everything I've done, everything I planned, it was all for us. This was supposed to be our future. Our future? future? Let me show you the future. Ay, ay, ay. Hello. Really, dude. In the Uranium zone. Oy, oy, oy. Mm. You. There you go. Alright, you're closer. So, to the point of interest to go. Ow. Oh, hello. Hmm, that's a lot of baddies, actually. I have to take a leak, so. Okay. Wait, he heard me? What? <laughs> Wait, how did he shoot me? Heavy armor. Okay, diamond. Come on, dude. Uh, psh, what can I? Oh. Hmm. First aid kit. Oh, that's uh, super good. There you go. Nice. Free medkit. I hope it hurts, motherfucker. Ow. Please let me in, dude. Deserter, uh oh. I guess I never expected a stalker to come to my aid. I'm looking for someone. Her name is Tatiana. Maybe you or the other soldiers came across her? Sorry, I've never oh. heard of her. And I'm just a grunt, so even if another patrol found her, they wouldn't tell me. I see. All right. I have to go. Good luck. Oh, wait. You oh. saved my life. Hey, I have to... a reward. Uh, nice. Here, take this. It's the least I can do. Food ration and two, two medkits. Oh, that's awesome. There we go. Alright, not in the apartment, so that's good. And Pipiat sign. This was supposed to be the future of the Soviet Union, a true atomic city. 
a place for the elite, scientists, engineers, artists, where everyone would be taken care of, where they all had a purpose and no one would want for anything. Yes. No poverty, no crime, no injustice, no inequality. But in the end, it was nothing but a glorified internment camp, infested with KGB goons sniffing around in other people's business. And when the Chernobyl disaster struck, they naturally looked after themselves first. Of course. Look at it now. A high-tech mausoleum full of ghosts. A utopia unraveled. A what true happened, utopia. Igor? The same thing that always happens. People. They just... They're irrational. No matter how much they have, they can't be satisfied. Always need to fuck something up. Create chaos. Chaos. And to me, this city was remarkable, regardless of the outcome. What was so special about it? Comic blocks. Oh, that. My sweet Professor Kimunik. Come with me. I'll show you some happy memories now. Yay, nice. 155 and then... Uh... Really? I'm full. Full of baloney. Uh, you go away. Can't go in. I wonder what's the red dot. Probably the uh, duster, of course. What? How does that happen? Ay, ay, ay. That was botched. I feel so ashamed. Sad life. Book. A name book. Can you feel it? Mm, can you smell that? It's the breeze off the Pripyat River. Flowers in bloom, coffee brewing, lemonade. We ate dessert and read together in the grass. Yes. You always brought science fiction. What was the name of that author you liked? <laughs> the Strugatsky brothers? Or Bulichov? Sometimes it felt like having a third person at the table. Huh. <laughs> that was fun. Do you remember the roar of the hydroplanes cruising to Kiev? You used to take me there. It was a long time ago, but yes, I think so. Come winter, we'd go skating on the river, just like my childhood in Murmansk. You used to move so fast, like a torpedo, spooking those poor really fishermen torpedo, sitting by that's their holes the, uh... in the ice. And I was such a horrible skater. <laughs> you were the worst. But you had me. I would always hold your hand and keep you from falling. I wish you were doing that right now. I need you, Tanya. So badly. I know. That's it. And my award, please. Chernobyl. Awesome. Out of here. There we go. Another day, another Chernobyl light. I just hope I get to use it again. I really do. Hey, not bad. Sex food. Alcohol. Alright. Let's go double for everyone. New items dropped on the ground. Comic salts. So, what does it do, Mousy? Do what? What does what do? Your magical thing. Your fancy device. Orana? Who? Ariadna. It uses low-level radiation measurements to reconstruct past events. Something like radiocarbon dating? <laughs> you surprised me, Tarakan. How do you know about these things? I don't know, Mousy. They sometimes come to me. Unconnected memories and bits of knowledge. The Rat King must be blocking them somehow. He should have the... Okay. Uh, You're not hand. wrong. It's like 
carbon dating, but a lot more advanced and in 3D. You see, every object is a dosimeter in a way, absorbing different types of radiation every millisecond. Ionizing radiation of thorium, potassium, uranium, and even uranium. cosmic rays. When it does, it creates a radioactive echo in time and space. With enough data, this echo can be traced and recreated using the fractal VR simulator. Does this mean you can see the past, Mousy? Is that how you hope to find out the truth about Tatiana and yourself? Yes. That's the idea. Yes. A wise mouse once said, Wise mouse. <laughs> if you want to discover the truth, you need to ask yourself, what is truth? What you're looking for may not be what you find, Mousy. True. That's a risk I'm willing to take. Nothing is more important to me than Tatiana. <laughs> Don't be so sure, Mousy. Ay, ay, ay. You, uh, I don't have any batteries. I've been shot a lot. Hey, nice slow. Tip. The fuck you want? Slow mo. Nope. Like you, 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 and you. Yeah, I'll take the two. Yeah, I don't need the rifle anymore. Like, I'm not even using it. But I do need revolver ammo, but... So you and... Yeah, with that. Well, nice. Build up some space. There we go. Nice. There we go. Nine. Boom. Nice. Oh, I'm running out of mushrooms. Uh, that's good enough. Doesn't want to talk. What's going on, Igor? Nothing. And Sashko. No. At bedtime. The heck is texting me? Eh. Day twenty-five, huh? Mm. Nothing. So. Hey there, old timer. Nice. I need you to do something for me. I'm all ears. You know, I came here to Chernobyl looking for someone. You mentioned a brother. Yeah, Ruslan. We grew up together in Moscow. Ow. We had to fend for ourselves from an early age. So you were, like, gangbangers? The proper really? term is thieves in law, but <laughs> you don't even know that. So why is Ruslan even here? It's a long story, but our father was a cop. Like a lot of cops, he was a real piece of shit. He beat our mother every time he got drunk, which yeah. was always. But I'll never forget the last time. He took a swing at my head with a lead pipe. But this time it didn't connect. Oh yeah, he beat her father. I wasn't a helpless right. little shit anymore, and neither was Ruslan. We grabbed the old man and threw him down the well behind the old house. He was just too much of a bastard to die. Oh yeah, he told me the broke story. His legs. You threw your own father down a well. I guess he must have deserved it. Okay, what's my role in all this? My brother Ruslan did something he shouldn't. And after this something, he came here to hide in the zone. I've been trying to track him down for months. Damn. What did he do that would make him hide in a place like this? That's not important right now. Anyway, my best guess is that he was caught by NAR. Ah, oh, I need to meet up with him and ask him some questions. This is very important to me. Search the NAR Mobile Command Center near the old hospital in Pripyat Port. All right. There are some officer uniforms that will help you infiltrate the power plant. 
And while you're at it, I want you to look up some info on my brother. Anything you can find on Ruslan Horovitz. Of course. Okay. I knew I could count on you, partner. Partner? Stay in touch, just in case. Radio me if you need help. I will. Nice. Binoculars. Alright. You. My mustache. You. Monster Hunt. 90. There we go. Five, yes. Let's go. Radio, more like radio. <laughs> you promised your friend something, and now you need to follow through. Well, yeah. Sashko is like a live grenade right now. One wrong move, and he'll explode. Be careful. I'm gonna be fine. Don't worry about me, I'm gonna be fine. Still haven't died there yet, by the way. Just use the adrenaline once. What am I stuck on, dude? A rock. I was just here, dude. Just here. I'm at the outpost. A lot of firepower here. Stay low. I could try my luck. See if I can take them out. You got balls. I'll give you that. But no. Lure them away from the outpost Wait, somehow. How? Use the field radio. I assume Olivier taught you how to fool these robots. Okay, you got a plan. Get to it. Oh, Living on the streets of Moscow teaches you how to think on your feet, huh? I like it. No dots. Ow. Whoa. Run away. Oh, there we go. Two dots. Hmm. There's no I'm gonna take them out. Look at this. Well, unless he moves away. Hello. <laughs> Oh no. So close. The heck was that? I'm at the radio station. Good stuff. You know what to do next. This is uh, Bluebird calling reinforcements to Alpha Bravo Papa. Found our fugitive. Look at this. Most wanted man in the zone. Over. What fucking bluebird? This is a restricted channel. Who the fuck is this? Uh oh. Ah, I'm not gonna make it. I'm dying. Interesting. I've witnessed plenty of people dying, and no one's ever said it straight up like <laughs> that. It just leaves me. <laughs> now, Wolf, last thing you want is for them to catch up to you and your bullshit. There you go. Just run up and take him out. Good. All those perks actually working out. Eh, didn't care about rifle ammo. I do care about this. Is that a guy? Here What's comes my savior. Are you in huh. need of more ammo? Hey, Mr. Clean, thank you for for the raid. Are you selling? Appreciate it, buddy. Uh, of course, only the best, custom-made stuff. How's your stream? Wait. 
Dummy. Yeah. Yeah. Custom made. It's just basic ones. Are you kidding me? You have ammunition. All kinds of it. Twenty rifle bullets for fun. Ooh, not bad actually, but uh, no need. Not good level. Well, what were you playing? If you don't mind me asking. Hmm. Whoop. My psyche, my psyche, dude. No one here. Good. Oh, someone here. Oh, he's looking my way. Yeah. Hmm. Don't look at me. Don't look at me, buddy. Don't look at me. Just crawling away. <laughs> Oh, there's more. I see two trucks. One of them's loaded with explosives, maybe. That's all. Go down there and take a closer look carefully. Well, how am I going to do that? Okay. There we go. Nice. I've got the uniform. Good. Nice. Now see if you can find anything on Ruslan. Team Rhino to combat ops. Team Rhino to combat ops. Over. Uh -oh. Go ahead, Team Rhino. False alarm. No enemy contact. We're falling back to the truck. Ha. Over and out. Suck Read it. me the fucking report, Igor. No. Uh, so, the troops and the one Ruslan Hobbits are new hire. Ooh. It seems good. they caught someone who enlisted under false name. They found out his real identity, Ruslan, and that he was wanted for double homicide in Moscow. Oh my God, Sashko, I'm sorry. They... I think they killed him in order to deny any involvement. Yeah, yeah, yeah. So, he's dead. I don't get to ask my questions then. What the hell is so Sucks. important about these questions? This is your brother. Yeah, I've seen this double homicide. It was our parents. I think Ruslan might have been involved in their deaths. Yeah. What are you saying? You think Ruslan killed your parents? I have no idea what happened. I wanted to find out from him directly. Well, now I mean, I, I get will. the father, but why the mother? Come on. You know your brother better than that. You and him saved your mum from your abusive asshole of a father. Do you honestly think he would harm her? Not intentionally, no, but maybe there was an accident. Crossfire. There you go. I know you didn't get what you wanted. But you should trust in your memory of Ruslan. I'll see you back at the base. You're out of your goddamn mind if you think you're going back now. What? What? Whatever he did or didn't do, Ruslan is still my brother. I need you to avenge him. Hey, nice. You should think things through first. Get some peace of mind. I don't want peace of mind. I want a piece of them. Nice. Find the place and send those NAR fuckers back to hell. Yes. I'm with you. Ruslan must be avenged. Appreciate it. Now, on the C4, grab the detonator and hide in the hospital. Wait for the right moment and press the button. Uh, where is C4? Ooh, what? Wait, that's a star. Huh. Uh oh I've got the detonator. Hide. I'm gonna Wait check that star. To I'm gonna check that star, dude. Hmm. Can I jump, please? Ah. I got a bad feeling about this. Hi. 
Oh no. There's one more. It's teleporting again. Oh well. We'll get the cutscene. I see then. them. Whenever you're ready, but don't hesitate. Who's that? Some stumble bomb is closing in on the checkpoint. Is that Mikhail's friend? Blow it up before he gets any closer. Do it. Uh -oh. What? No fucking way! That old bastard is way too valuable! Don't you fucking dare! Blow it. The bluey. Oh, well. I did it! For fuck's sake, he's got important contacts! We drank vodka together! Sorry. It had to be done. It had to be. Fuck you! If that really was some vagrant wandering around, I wouldn't give a shit! But he was really fucking useful to me! Fuck! Yeah. Uh, let's check the star one. That was bad. Ugh. Not good at all. Fire! Uh, let's check the star. What? I wonder what that is actually. Because usually it just was a, a circle. That's not good. Oh, it's the, the, the Here comes my savior. Oh. Oh, never mind then. Ugh. I'm not gonna waste food rations on ammo. Yeah, what the heck? No way. Bloody fucking hell! You just blew that poor asshole into pieces! Why? Why did you do that? I needed him! You have no idea how this fucks things up for me! I'm sorry. I know he was your friend. Nah, he wasn't. But he was really useful. I'm disappointed in you, Igor. Oh, well. You let your emotions cloud your judgment and screw up my business. Oh well. Sucks to suck then, I guess. Seven food, nice. Double. Double. One and one. Oh, I'm full HP. Full everything. Awesome. Uh, still nothing. They are close, Mercy. I can hear them screeching under the floor. Filthy rodents. Huh. Rats, you mean? You think those furry buggers can eat through a concrete wall? Probably not. Something is amiss. The Rat King. I can't hear him anymore. Is he gone? He's never truly gone. But sometimes he goes away, and then it's like... What? It's like the cobwebs are all blown away. I can think clearly for a moment. And I remember... Who's the Red King? Things. Who is the Red King? What do you remember? A hospital. People in white gowns. A madman strapped to a gurney, screaming in terror. And myself. I'm strapped down too. Why are you doing this? I don't belong here. Let me out. Calm down. Everything's so going to be fine. Okay. It's all in the past now. You can't keep me here against my wishes. Tarakan, please. You're safe now. What? Where am I? Mikhail's warehouse. You're safe. Nobody is safe from the Rat King, Little Mouse. Not ever. Don't you ever forget that. Ah, uh, yes. Our old friend, the Rat King. I guess everything's back to normal then. Okay. I actually don't like that. Uh, What's going on, Igor? The morale is bad. The relation status is bad. I mean. 
it's fine. Like a view. Hello. Nice. The fuck you want? Bad. Uh, I take you, 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 you. It's all messing up when I pick ammo. But that's almost full, are you kidding me? Oi, oi, oi. Should craft another cabinet just for that. Wait, one. Whoa, other side. Oh, that's new. Yes. Oh, don't crash. Oof. 26. Oh, someone's gonna give me a mission. Nope. Wow, it's great to see you, Igor. I've got a fan fucking spastic plan that you need to hear. <laughs> yeah, right, of course. Sounds fan fucking exciting. Nice. Stop bitching and be grateful there's someone here to do the thinking when you're not around. Ha! Anyway, listen up. I think the time has come to kill off the biggest knobber of them all. Nice. Oh, the suspense is killing me. Who's on your shit list today? Me. Drum roll, please. -la 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 -la. General Koslov, the single biggest NAR twat of them all. Nice. Time to end his miserable life. Pay back for what he did to my friends. And for his other shameful deeds, of course. Can't forget that. <laughs> You've got friends? That's new. Uh oh. Yeah, very funny. This fucker and his cronies iced my boys. Don't you ever joke about that. You fucking hear me? His lapdogs captured us, tortured us. So we're killing him. I, got I guess that's good. Just good, good, good. good. If we're killing him. And left me to die. Uh, what happened? Know. You never wanted to talk about it before. Having electrodes clipped to your dong is not something you want to relive with casual acquaintances. <laughs> the five of us set up this warehouse together. It was me, Zena, Yuri, Udmila, and Igor. Like yourself, we were the fucking Pripyat, Pripyat five, five. yes. Respected businessmen and women. We provided uh, essential goods and services for those who needed them. When NAR showed up, we tried to negotiate with them. But to this decrepit 20th century Kami Kozlov, we were just a bunch of hippie anarchists and drug dealers. Oy, oy, oy. Anyway, a perfect opportunity to exact revenge on this cocksucker's approaching. He's gonna give some kind of motivational speech to his private army of knobbers Ooh, outside in a Lenin big Square. Fight, then, as I guess. much as I admire clean work, shooting him like a lame deer would be a mistake. We should make him talk first. Learn everything we can so we can better prepare for a heist. Passwords, codes, guard routines. After we have what we need, then we off him. I also want to ask him about my brother. I need to know why he went to the trouble of killing Ruslan when he was just asking for a job. We are going to pull the Rat King's teeth one by one. So yeah, let's question him first. Yeah. yeah, 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 that's a good, great idea. But we should question him first. Killing him straight away would waste all the work we put into exposing his big plans and the end of the world and all that. Uh, to we need Kozlov alive. I'm open to suggestions. I can definitely help with that. The actual camp is located in Energetic, the former palace of culture. Palace there are two culture, ways okay. in. The main entrance is probably guarded, of course, but they only post two guards at the side door. You know the place, right? Of course. Yeah. I lived here a long time ago, but some of the details are fuzzy. It's not complicated. Those NAR fuckers just walked in and make themselves at home. The front entrance is a no-go, but the side door will be a breeze. The guard detail is very light. Insultingly so. <laughs> and that's where you come in, or go in, or whatever. Kaslov's digs are on the top floor. Once you get inside, 
It shouldn't be hard for a man of your talents to slip past the guards. Security is a bit of a joke, like every fascist you ever met. They got cocky. They're not expecting anyone to snoop around. And remember, most of them will be distracted by Kozlov's speech. Maybe he'll even put them to sleep for us. <laughs> this is a great opportunity, Mousy. The Rat King's minion will be vulnerable. Alone. Just waiting for you. The time has come to instill the fear of the great rat nice. in their do black it. and shrivel Where's Olivia, hearts. though? Okay. I'm ready to talk to Kosov. Why are you doing nothing? Wait, tools are called 4 out of 5. What did I get? No. Ah, stolen from the yeah 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 nice, that's the one. So bit by bit we're etching closer. Food up, you food stash, you monster hunt, you and who's left? Sashko. Wait no. Oh, there's two monster hunts. Zero percent, nice. Okay, there you go. An actual main main mission. Uni, oh, good damn. Kostler, Uni, my man. How the you doing? Most hated man in the zone. He's ruthless, but hardly a mastermind. How you Despite doing? Despite his civilized appearance, he may just be a mad dog unleashed by the NAR. Still, you could probably learn a lot from him. He could be your ticket into the power plant. Alright. Big, big mission. Only took two hours to get here. Mm. Alright. No side missions. Alright, I'll be right back. I'll be right back. Enjoy music.
It was the best of times. It was the blurst of times. You stupid monkey. <laughs> That's oh, stupid shit. monkey. All right, buck. Let's go. Bad news, Igor. Uh oh. What's going on? Kozlov is about to leave the NAR encampment. Very convenient timing, isn't it? Convenient indeed. So, change of plans? Go to Hotel Policia. Go to the A, Eddie. You'll have a great vantage point from up there. It will allow you to pinpoint Kozlov. Sounds good. Excellent. We should pursue this Oh, no, it's a heavy. This will bring us closer to defeating the Rat King. You're one oh, psycho old really. geezer, Terrican. But I like you because you love to stir shit up. <laughs> Working with you is a real pleasure. You may be far from divine enlightenment, Sashko. But your heart yep. is in the right place. Ooh, calming salts. Awesome. Smell. Take a shit out here or what? <laughs> the heck? Ah, that's a lot of bad guy. Uh oh. Just walk past. Oh no. Can't see me, can't see me. Bye bye. Eddie, my man. Whoa. Uh oh, they're gonna be searching for me. Select the words on my chat when the stream starts. Uh oh. I I saw ah, shoot. Ah, damn it. That's not good. Alright, time to snipe then, I guess. He does have the greenest of all time. <laughs> really? That did only that little damage. Damn it, he saw me. Dummy! I guess. Think. Ooh. Elevator? Maybe. Should I use the elevator? I think that's the idea. No. Okay. Nice. Hello. All right. Don't care about ammo. Use. Uh oh. There is the bastard. I'm on the top floor, and I found some binoculars. Good. Conveniently placed. Luck famous bold mouses like yourself. I see him, General Kozlov in the flesh. The chief rat. Chief now rat. Listen closely, no. mousy. His living quarters are in the building on your right, top floor. The time for action is now. Gather your courage and go, mousy. Uh, what about a little help? Perhaps some kind of diversion? Yes, luring the other predators away is always a good idea. Use the generator to power up the ferris wheel. It's light. Wait, where's the generator? If it's like somewhere rush. else, I'll just like not rush. do that. That might work for a minute or two, but it won't last. Do you have a better idea? I might. Ooh. Shut down the generator instead, and they'll be blind. Oh. Then you'll have no problem sneaking past the guards and getting to your target. Do I have a choice? Or do I just leave? Hmm. 
นะบองอะไรเขาเดอเอลเวตอร์ไม่ไม่ไม่ไม่ไม่ไม่ไม่ไม่ไม่ไม่ไม่ไม่ไม่ไม่ไม่ไม่ไม่ไม่ไม่ไม่ไม่ไม่ไม่ไม่ไม่ไม่ไม่ไม่No one sees me. I'm fine. Oh, that's not good. A lot of bad guys. Param param param. Who would see me here, dude? No one here. Just one above. I get in here. I have to go through there. There's only one guy. He's walking away from me. Cool. Bye bye. <laughs> Easy. Not to get the other guy. Twenty-six. Wait, still above. What do you mean? Oh, that's a heavy. No, it's not. I can't distinguish heavies. That, that little light. I like how the gun just destroys itself. Hmm. Okay, good enough. And wait, no. Okay, I'm at the generator. Rip. The shadows are out! Fucking hell! Fire! Fire at will! Target the head! Over there! Oh. Keep shooting! Oh, I'm coming! Uh oh. Watch your six! Stay alert! What did I just do? Must have opened the shadow cages! <laughs> the guards will be quite busy for the next little while! Not afraid of the dark, are you? Seriously, though? No. Watch yourself. Those things will eat you just as soon as any guard. Ugh. Got better than nice. Okay. Ah, shoot. Hmm. Move away, move away, son. Bye bye. Yes. Whoa, 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 whoa. Why is he on, on blocks? Whoa. Can't pick up. Uh, you go away. God damn it. No one heard that? Cool. Can't pick up my shoes. Ay, ay, ay. Alright, I am on the correct floor. Oof. No one heard that. Hello. 
Don't even think about reaching for that sidearm, General Koslov. <laughs> this conversation is not going to go the way you think. Really? And here I thought you were a civilized man, a gentleman and a scholar. Was I wrong? Regardless, my men are waiting outside the building. You're trapped. I will be very interested to see how you handle this situation. Come I'll on. He's just trying to weasel his way out of it. Kill him now. Don't let him get in your head. I'm sorry, General. Questions I'm not first. that kind of person. But you leave me no choice. Wait, you're making a huge Ooh. mistake. I can tell you a great many things. Useful information. He's full of shit. Just pop him and blow. You want to know about Tatiana, right? Yes. Then you found the right man. Let's talk. Talk. Okay. Talk. I'll bite. But you better have answers. Did you think I would be impressed? I've seen these things before. Don't make your situation any worse than it already is. Move. Oh, and I'm leaving as well. Okay. Will not like this. Come on, Mikhail. Don't be stupid. Oh, hello. All of us are here. So, this is what it looks like from the inside. Surprised? I guess you're not all knowing after all. Let's say terrorist hideouts are not my department. Terrorist. Dude. But I know everything I need to know. Is this a family meeting? What a pity. I thought we were going to talk man to man, Professor Kaminiuk. What the fuck? Why did you bring this asshole here? You were supposed to punish him for what he did, and then leave his corpse as an example. My poor fellow. I suppose you expect me to acknowledge you and apologize for something I've done. Oof. Sadly, I am forced to disappoint you. I have no idea who you are, nor do I care. Yikes. What about you, old man? Still chasing ghosts? Did oh, he knows about them. Mysterious Ooh. rat king. Perhaps you should have stayed in the institution. At least they kept you properly fed. Sashko Horobets. I admire your craft, but there's nothing I can do for you. Or your brother. We'll see about that. Are we done with introductions? Let's get to it then. You seem to be the most reasonable of this gang of colorful misfits. <laughs> misfits, okay. I was hoping you and I could have a civilized conversation. I know exactly what you're doing. It isn't particularly clever or original, and it's not going to work. What am I doing? I am a professional who happens to be on the other side of the fence. Just a man trying to do his job. I have a nephew that I very much want to see. Who cares about so, the nephew? Go ahead and ask your questions. When you're satisfied, I'm sure we can come to some kind of arrangement. Your nephew? Tell me about him. Oh. He's ten years old. He's from Magnitogorsk, like his father and me. And he's the smartest kid I know. Who I cares? don't believe for one moment that you could harm him. It simply isn't your style, Professor. Besides, you don't even know where he is. Do not assume to know me, Koslov. That would be a so, mistake. I wouldn't harm him. But, but, I would harm him, so. Tell me about the experiments. What is Semenov doing in the lab? I wish I could tell you. But as with tracking down trespassers, that is not my department. My task was to ensure Semenov could work undisturbed. National you lie. Him. I've seen everything. I've even studied Chernobylite myself. How can you claim to know nothing about it? I know about its applications, yes. I know that it can act as an unlimited energy source, that it can be used in transportation, medicine, and can even be weaponized. But I don't know any details about its implementation. I'm not a scientist, just an old soldier. Yes, I suppose that's true. Look, I'm not a personal friend of Semenov. His findings may be profound, but at what cost? Remember, it was Semenov who botched the experiment that released the shadows True. into this world. Yes, yes, yes. Can you guess how many people I've lost fighting those things? Don't ask me where these creatures came from, because I have no idea. From a nightmare, perhaps. Semenov has a god complex. He believes he can advance the human race. A bold claim, especially in this part of the world, no? 
We lived in the shadow of people who wanted to turn us simple bread eaters into angels for almost the entire century. But I've been around. I've seen things. So you can understand why I'm skeptical when I hear such claims. Okay, next. Semenov may be the brain, but he isn't responsible for the atrocities in the zone. That's your doing. Hmm. You seem like a smart fellow, Kaminyuk. Why would you buy into this nonsense? What do you mean? Whatever Semenov told you, he is the real puppet master. He has great influence over the board. The board? The big money people in the tailored Italian suits. So I should the kill them make money while by making ago. money. Oh, yeah. Semenov convinced the board he's going to transform NAR into a trillion dollar business. To them, he's like an investment banker messiah. Semenov isn't rounding people up and torturing them, filling mass graves with civilian corpses. That's you. Well, naturally, you'll get a distorted view of what's going on when you only hear one side of the story. Uh-huh. What's your side of the story, then? This is a war zone. I am responsible for keeping my men safe and doing my Killing job. Killing innocents, though. Hmm. Some collateral damage is unavoidable in any conflict. But trust me when I say I've already had a belly full of civilian misery. And misery is I do my point. absolute best to keep their suffering to a minimum. I'm only really interested in one thing. Where is Tatiana? That ghost you're chasing. Hm. That pretty dream. I don't know what to tell you. You're the head of security. Am I to believe you're not privy to everything that goes on at the power plant? Professor Kaminiuk, listen. I am here to earn a little extra money so I can retire someplace nice and send my nephew to an Ivy League university. I have zero interest in anything that doesn't directly concern my men and my job. You don't tell me. I swear. I cannot tell you what I do not know, Professor. Semenov is the authority in this area. Talk to him if you want to know more about the experiments or this Tatiana girl. Damn. How do I enter that power plant? You're placing me in a very awkward position. You want me to divulge information that may lead to casualties among my men and the civilian staff. <laughs> You've got a real nerve talking to me about civilian casualties. I can't believe you would try that. Again, what is the password and response for accessing the power plant? Don't be stupid. You and your merry band of trumps will never make it out of the power plant Trumps. alive. Dude, come on. I don't care. Do you know where we are right now? No. I don't understand it, this place. But let's skip the guessing game and you just tell me. We are currently in the tunnel between two singularities. It's like a black hole, only smaller. This tunnel is a shortcut through time and space. Marvelous, isn't it? But to use it, you need to know how to enter and how to leave. Ah, I see where this is going. Ah. Do you? I don't have to kill you. I can simply leave you here. But don't count on dying anytime soon. Time dilation will ensure that you don't. Also invisible walls. You'll never see your nephew again. But perhaps I will release you to attend his funeral when he's died of old age. I can see that your companion's cruel nature is beginning to rub off on you. <laughs> Very well. Are you ready to cooperate now? If you lie to me, I will return and it won't go well for you. The call is, we quell the storm. The response and ride the thunder. Thank you. Quell the I'm storm. glad we had this chance okay. to talk. What to do with you now, eh? I want to ask him about wrestling fast. He's mine. I want him to experience a slow descent into hell. Fucker! He's just a tool of the Rat King. He told you everything of value already. Do not let this rodent roam free. He can still do oh, yeah, great we're, we're damage him, to our obviously. cause, more even than before. Sorry, I can't let you go. You're making a mistake, Professor. One you will dearly regret. Hmm. Hmm. Mikhail, you deserve to have your revenge. 
Thank you, my friend. You can go now. I can take it from here. Trust me. God, no! This is... Please! I don't deserve this! Hmm. But you said you didn't remember who I was! Oh, boy. Let's see if I can refresh your memory. God damn you, Kaminyuk! Not this sociopath! I'm begging you! Kill me! Just kill me, please! Anyone! Nope. Okay. Cause of doing cause of... Oh, yeah. Okay. Okay, we are here. Nice. One of the main missions done. Cool. Nice. Uh, yeah, everyone's got double. Why not? Calming salts. Seven med kits now. Wait. Come on, open up. You, 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 you. I think I, I should craft a adrenaline. Just in case, it all goes to hell. Nice. Ah, talk to me, buddy. What's going on, Igor? Oh, nothing. But Bunch, or a couple. It's nothing. What's the matter, Mousy? Nothing. Okay, and Mikhail. The fuck you want, dude? Still bad. Sucks. Building tools that's full. Containers new. It's full. Weapon smith. Wait. Oh, macro pistol. Oh, right. I'm not sure why not. Classic design requires a loan of each other, but comes in for. High connect force and uh, quiet. Oh, it's quiet. Okay. Eh, whatever. I gotta talk to everyone. Okay. Still insufficient. Alright, on to the next day. Day 27. Almost a full month. Nothing. Nothing. Huh. To drop you. Munitions. You. To drop you. Okay. Tools are called 5 of 5. Nice. Ah, well, can I can actually start the heist. Okay, cool. 
That all that saved? Okay. So we'll check the ghost of the past. Then we'll see what's from there. Ooh, one point of interest. 386. Are you kidding me, game? Oy, oy, oy. Stoves. Semyon, Semyon. What did Semyon do? Forgot. That's fine. I like how the stove actually is still there after like three weeks of in-game time. Oh shoot, the radiation. Yeah, the water doesn't help, buddy. Run! Yeah, well. Just run him through, cause uh. I don't need to pick up anything. It's all good. Come on, man. What the heck is this? Come on. What's the locksmith? Hello, fellow prospector. I have a favor. What's on your I came sorry. Eh, whatever. Do you have any I thought Lockpick Twenty six in the month of dude, come on. Let's, Let's see just... what you No, oh, hell no. Okay, Save travels, my friend. I can't believe that was a question mark. I already found him here, like before. That's the place plane that crashed. Oh, heli. Oh, an AK. Eh. Really, dude? I'm stuck. Bruh. Really? I move. Dude, I'm stuck. What the hell? Nice meal. Fifty eight. Yeah. Load it up. I think it auto saves quite often. Yeah, like literally here. Nice. Cool. There we go. Pictures, something. This used to be a typical village. Papachi. A simple hamlet of a thousand souls. These people had lives, families. It was all taken from them, scattered, stolen or destroyed, buried underground. Buried. And now it's Ooh. nothing but a sprawling sort of mass grave. It had to be done. The radionucleotides from the fallout contaminated this entire area. I can see that. Liquidators risked their lives to deactivate this place. Deactivate? <laughs> How very dry and technical. But it doesn't quite capture the terror that befell these people. We took the same classes in radio physics in Leningrad. You know what I mean. Of course I do. But think about it. How quickly can you bury someone's life and past? Make it disappear? Change it. Twist it. Make it as if it never existed. Doesn't it frighten you? A bit. A lot of things frighten me right now, my love. Buried houses, ruined furniture, and missing feather beds aren't high on my list of scares, though. Shouldn't be. Do you think this is funny? 
You should be frightened, you know. Very frightened. Oh, going back. Really, game. This is not far. A ball. Ew. Constructed in honor of the 50th anniversary of the Great October Revolution. There was a friend I met at a book club, Lena. She used to be a kindergarten teacher. She was always so devoted to the little ones. Their future was her job, her calling. Have you ever wondered how it was for the children of the zone? Uh, the evacuation, the radiation sickness. Iodine-131 is especially dangerous for kids. The little thyroids absorb it like a sponge. Oof. I'm not talking about that. They were supposed to be safe, protected. The party said the children came before everything else. That's before a lie. nuclear energy, before the arms race with the West, and all the shiny medals and glorious parades on Red Square. Those children's world collapsed that night before they even had a chance to properly know it. I sometimes think those kids never left, that their souls still wander here. Yeah, I can hear the voices. Trapped oh, yeah, yeah, yeah. in those dolls, watching and waiting. Oof. Scary. Oh, what nonsense. Spoopy. Calm yourself, Igor. I'm not done yet. Ba -da -ba -ba. Whoop. Jump! Oh, can't jump. You're kidding me, game. Why can't I jump that? Well, of course. Whoa. Fence. And you are sign. Ooh. That, that looks good. I, Igor Kunik, joining the ranks of the Vladimir Ilyich Lenin All Union Pioneer Organization in the presence of my comrades, solemnly promise to love and cherish the motherland, to live according to the great Lenin's principles. As the Communist Party teaches us, as is required by the laws I mean, of the pioneers did that, so of the why Soviet so Union. About it? Very funny. The young pioneer camp stirs up memories. Yes, you must have been a role model for your companions back then. Do you still have your red neckerchief? I, I can't remember. Oof. I was never a fan of state-controlled organizations. Besides, I preferred to keep to myself. I think. You think? A loner. Perhaps that's what you were meant to be all along. Oh, come on. What do you mean? Maybe we were a mistake, Igor. I sometimes wonder how it would have been if we'd brought a child into this... this fucked up world. Yes. Don't say it like that. It was our dream. Such dreams are dangerous. Should have had sex Like an often. unstable element. If something can go up in flames, it eventually will. All it takes is one spark. In my Chernobyl, please. Thank God. All right, we out of here. I like how I moved to the left for some reason. Nice. Oh, make it nice. All right, double, 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 double. Inventory is full, of course it is. Shot and slug. Yeah. The fuck you want? Bro. What's the matter, Marcy? Oh, is it? Staff just appeared. Nice meme. Alright, uh. Oh, there's nothing. I'm just full loaded on stuff. Okay, cool. And. You. What's going on, Igor? Nothing. Okay. That's still insufficient. Okay.
I wonder what's today gonna bring. Day 28. Feel that you are ready to return to the power plant, you can do it at any time. The board that allows you to check the plan is next to where you assign missions every day. Okay. So that's nothing. So I can actually do the final mission. Are we ready? I think we are. Everyone, it's time to hit the power plant. We all know it's not going to be easy. We tried before, and not everyone made it. Oof. But this time we're smarter and better prepared. I know we can do this. We have to do this. It's the only way we can find Tachana and end NAR. Mousy, you're talking about striking at the heart of the Rat King. But have you learned everything possible about his plans? I have evidence that NAR was conducting Chernobylite experiments back in the 90s. Tachana and her baby were two of their subjects. With the rate at yeah, which their technology is progressing, then. soon, nothing will be able to stop them. We must act now. What about that black mask wearing motherfucker? Have you identified him? His name is Boris Glukov. Nice. He, Tachana and I were close friends until he betrayed us. He helped the KGB gather evidence against Tachana, then continued to work for NAR after my accident. I think this is their he final mission. He experimented on himself with Chernobylite and ended up with great power. He's strong, one of the strongest, but we can beat him together. Nice. I like the pep talk, Professor. I think you even gave me a bit of a job. <laughs> we have the right tools for the job. Aye, aye, aye. Yes, we do. We've got everything we need to infiltrate the power plant. This is much bigger than anything any of us has done before. If you want to back out, this is your chance. One organization holding this much power is against everything I believe in. And besides, this is personal for me. Nice. Count me in. You know how I feel. The Red King must be stopped at all costs, Mousy. I'm in. I started out doing this for a paycheck. But I'm going to end it for my brother in arms. For Anton. Let's do this. Oh, you think I'm gonna back out now and miss the best part? <laughs> Fuck no. I'm with you, Igor. I appreciate your trust. We can't count on the element of surprise, but we know enough about NAR's vulnerabilities to make this work. Time and again, NAR has shown they would rather capture than kill me. We can use this to our advantage. We'll dress somebody up as an NAR officer, escorting a prisoner. Me. me. That's our ticket inside. We have two NAR uniforms, both male. Any takers? I'll do it. I have no problem posing as an NAR officer. My hand is still giving me trouble, but I can deal with it. It's been a month, take dude. someone who can keep his cool when things go sideways, as they inevitably do. Trust me on that. You're not seriously thinking about going without me? I'm a blast <laughs> at parties. Ask no, anyone. Yeah. Uh, yes. All right, we still have one more uniform. Any takers? Yeah. Yeah, NAR must have upgraded its digital defense perimeter and surveillance system by now. A skillful hacker should be able to at least temporarily disable them. Bro. I'm your man, Mousy. The great rat catcher has blessed me with a knack for that kind of thing. Electronics, surveillance, computers. There's no one better than me. Good, 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 good. I need someone to cover our asses in case we end up in the shit. Someone who can take down a target from a distance. Or at least create a diversion. Firearms are my preferred method of solving problems. But I can definitely distract them. No. The shooting's impaired since I injured my hand. But I can manage. Wait, what? Thinking it over a bit more, I don't think we need a sniper or operations person. If we stick to the plan, everything should go smoothly. Last but not least, a spy. I want someone to monitor NAR activities and keep us informed about their moves. I've been watching these assholes fight the reflection for years. I know how they think. Nice. I'm your guy. I know the power plant like a boy knows the woods behind his house. Let me take care of it. Yeah, Does everyone know what to do? 
Last chance to reconsider. Let's do it. This is it, my love. The last stretch. Final you mission, buddy. Do so much for me. Make sure you're ready, because it will take everything you have. Your wits, your strength, your plan, your companion's loyalty, everything. Mm. Good luck, my love. So to our great, to our bad. So either either those two are gonna sabotage it, or nothing's gonna happen. So. Uh. This is it. Whoa. Today's the day. Whatever happens. Okay, that's full, and I have six batteries. Yes, five and. Six. Everything sorted, guys. Yeah, whatever. Can we start our prisoner escort off? I'm ready. Though my hand still hurts like hell. If the uniform doesn't get us in, we have one more ace up our sleeve. Their friend enemy password. They say we quell the storm. And we reply and ride the thunder. Remember it. Before we enter the lion's den, I need to triple check everything is ready. How's my techie? Have you logged into their system? I'm in, Halsey. What do you need me to do? Overload their systems? Bypass security? Let's do it. You ask and I'll do it. But don't be rash. Once we get started, it's only a matter of time before they kick me out again. Spy check. How are my eyes and ears? Eyes are bright and my ears are wide open. I got the plans and codes up and I can hear those boring fuckers chatter like they were sitting in my lap. No worries, Igor. With me on your side, this will be like walking to the grocery store. <laughs> aye, aye. There are a few sentries outside the gate. That's obstacle number one. Better use the side passage for now. You can always kill them on your way out. <laughs> Don't forget that you're a prisoner, Igor. Downcast, hopeless. Use this to our advantage. Hmm. Yeah. Prisoner. Okay. Showtime. This better work. I just hope uh, I get to keep my weapons, though. Oh. I don't. I have nothing, yikes. Hello. Oh, who goes there? Stand down, Private, and clear the way. I'm escorting this stalker to his interrogation. Yeah, I mean, yes, sir. Uh, you can find the brass in the tent behind the gates. I assume you know the way. Can't check him out. Sucks. Closed up. Okay. Good. Th Look how they're escorting me. I'm just walking along. <laughs> so far, so good. But it's getting harder now. NAR's upgraded some of the old security features. Oh boy. What now? Security checkpoint. What used to be a radiation detector is now a biometric scanner. Clever. I already found the right database. Cool. I'll upload your biometric data and you can walk right through. Those NAR security systems can be broken by someone with enough know how. Those IT wankers probably spent their upgrade budget on porn hub premium content. <laughs> Once those gates read my biometrics, my cover will be blown. We need to convince them somehow that we're friendlies. Hmm. Tarakan, I like your thinking. One moment. Yes, done and done. Nice. This case won't be a problem, Percy. Time to move. With a little luck, they won't notice us. And zap. Nice. Still smooth. And there is little no one here.
entrance should be very close. It's a large metal door to the tech access corridor. Nothing I can't handle. Remember the charges I prepared for breaching security doors? Powerful, but quiet. Nice. Like sticking a curling iron into a pound of butter. Or maybe you want to save them for later. Ooh. Keep your hand down, Igor. There's a fucking sniper on the building above you. Stop yelling. How do you know? Picked it up on the radio. They haven't made you yet, but if you trigger the alarm, they'll come down on you like a swarm of Katyushas. Damn. If I force the lock, it'll trigger the alarm. Uh-oh. This will be tough. I can try to remotely unlock the door without tripping the alarm, but no guarantees. You'll have to move very quickly, Mousy. The lock is wired to the alarm system, but Sashko's charges will destroy both the lock and the trigger mechanism. I should be fine. Hmm. Yeah, quite the burn, I guess. Charges He's, armed. He did Stay nothing. Back. It still says close, dude. Uh oh. Another life lost because of you. What happened to your grand plans? Uh -oh. Your companion is about to meet his end in this reality. You should figure out what led to this so you can plan accordingly next time. Bop. Ay, ay, ay. What's happening? This had to happen, Igor. You need to be saved. We all need to be saved. Olga. Did you just... There's no other way. She asked me to save you from the worst fate imaginable. Damn. Have you lost your goddamn mind? You're not making any sense. You can run, Igor. But you cannot hide from this. What the fuck? The electronics are sizzling as if they're going to explode. That's to be expected, Mousy. The power plant's electrical system is antiquated, falling apart. We should find a way to short... I have access to the circuit board. Perhaps I can cut power to the nearest corridor. Have you been listening, Mousy? I can turn off the entire sector remotely, no problem. Hmm. I'll only leave the light on at your location. Tarakan, I like your thinking. Okay, do Today, it. the darkness is our friend, Mousy. You're completely now safe. Oh, I do have weapons now, okay. It's good. Shame about Sashko, though. Yeah. I like how the NPC just ran off. What the heck? And I have no idea where I'm going. And I'm running in circles, you know? Yeah. Oh, okay. We're getting close to the reactor floor. I think we managed to dodge the main security detail. As long as we maintain our cover, we should be good. Step very fucking lightly now, Igor. The place is swarming with those cocksuckers. NAR's beefed up security around Ark for some reason. Either they're preparing for something, or you're walking straight into a goddamn trap. Oof. Well, there goes. I'm in the Golden Corridor. It looks like NAR beefed up security after our little escapade. Not unexpected. Time to play our prisoner escort car. If they don't buy it, we will kill them. Wait, Olivier died? Uh oh. <laughs> Let's try the prisoner escort charade. Just even act worse. Bored. Stop right there. I don't recognize you, soldier. We quell the storm? And rat the thunder. Now step aside. I'm bringing this criminal filth to talk to the high rubs. Okay, go ahead. Nice. Oof. 
Oh, heavy. Yeah. I hope nothing bad happens. Oi, oi, oi. these scientists the brainiacs have their own dedicated comms i can put my fabulous acting skills to work and tell them to fuck off but it's a two-man job the great rest catcher has smiled upon you today i can help nice this is fucked even if they somehow bought our cover story who would escort a prisoner to the reactor hmm. Terracan, i like your thinking Sounds good, Nasty. It shouldn't take long to hack the comms. Attention! Pneumonia! Achtung! The reactor is about to explode! Run for your lives, everyone! What kind of nonsense is this? The reactor cannot ex- Fuck it, Anatolia. A break is a break. Heh! <laughs> they just leave. Okay, fine by me. Hello. Do I have my weapon? Good. Yeah, I really need that. These old ventilation ducts will take me straight to the Ark. Oh what no. What the hell is this? Was it here before? Looks like some sci-fi fucking movie prop. The door is trapped. Touch it, and I'll spend my last moments on Earth convulsing on the dirty floor. This door wasn't supposed to be here. Mousy, the ventilation duct should not be secured. The Red King is watching and waiting. I can feel it. Wait, Igor, remember the map you borrowed from that fucker Semenov? It shows another way in. Guess it was worth it in the end, huh? Okay. Uh... Your plan sounds reasonable, Mikhail. Do it. The doors are behind you, Igor. Cut through the crap on the other side, and you'll find a nice, fat ventilation duct. Climb up in there, and it'll take you straight to the Ark. My butthole is... like, tight. He teleported. No way, he just ran. Uh oh. Oh, hello, Igor. I've been expecting you. Damn it. Seminar. Seminar. You said you didn't want any part of this. Explain yourself. <laughs> you are remarkable, my boy. Yes, ask your questions, please. I have to say, you earned that right through your hard work and persistence. Tanya, where is she? You've always known where she is. She's here. Alas, that is the wrong question. What do you mean, the wrong question? What, what do you mean? You should be asking, what is she? Oh. If you hurt her in any way... Stop, please. Stop playing the role of a naive, lovesick puppy dog. After everything you've seen, everything you've learned, you embarrass yourself with your petty personal concerns. I'll spell it out for you. If you haven't the stomach to see it for yourself, Tatiana is a crucial part of our Chernobylite experiment. She always has been. There were other candidates, but no way she is the black star. Us, it was always going to be her. We're going to use Tatiana to create a stable wormhole to the Chernobylite world. Oh. She will travel there and help us reach its source. With her help, I will usher in a new era of human civilization. This is madness. 
I should have killed you the first time I saw you. My God, is this display of moral outrage supposed to impress me? You must put your maudlin sentiments aside, Igor. The world cares nothing for such things. The only real force in this life is change and growth, evolution, exploration, the act of discovery. Everything else is a substitute, an excuse meant to justify a meaningless, pathetic existence. Not for me, my boy. My boy. And you. You are my biggest regret. Did you know that? I made a mistake letting you go. Yikes. It was supposed to be special. So very fucking special. That brain, those talents, all that glorious potential has been wasted on empty, sentimental pursuits. I failed you, yes. Please don't argue with me. And for that, I sincerely apologize. I'm okay. going to save Tatiana. Stay out of my way and I won't kill you. For now. Unfortunately, no. I cannot allow you to meddle in my affairs anymore. Goodbye, my boy. Oh, shoot. Oh, no. What's wrong with you, Igor? How foolish can you be? How did you not see this coming? Your companion's fate has been sealed in this timeline. The least you can do is consider what led to this. Ow. He did. Ay, ay, ay. Ah. Really, one hit and he's dead. Sashko! Oh, good lord! The Rat King! Sashko, can you hear me? See something! You cannot hesitate, Murphy. Uh. We will mourn the fallen when this is all over. Whoa, and that missed, really. Ay, 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 what a waste. Alright, reload. Ugh. Woo, hello. Like we'll have to fight our way out. These guys are the last thing standing between me and Tatiana. Aye, aye, aye. I can't back down now. I'll fight my way in if I have to. Oh no, this sucks big time balls. I wish we had someone inside who could get those assholes to look the other way. There's no other choice. Really? Spotted. Wow. the batteries dude damn it thank you head yes all right psyche 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 where's my alcohol Shotgun slug. Oh, I do need that. Uh, go away. Twelve. Okay, that should last me a bit. Come on, 
at the plates already. Tatiana, finally. Igor, my oh no, love. Mm. my child. It's been so very long, but it's finally you. It has to be you. You know it in your heart, my love. I've been calling out to you for all these years, and you answered. But how? You shouldn't be here. It's a mistake. Uh -oh. You'll only bring great misery on us all. My poor little boy. That's not good. All of us together, finally. Release me, my love. Free me. She's gonna die. What did you call me? I don't understand. What can I do? There's nothing you can do. You have to end this. Both of us. We were a mistake. An abomination. Close the portal. Destroy the connection. What connection? The connection is the strongest force in the universe. She's it gonna die, be destroyed. Buddy. It has to be completed. It is our destiny. Go to the reactor. Find it, my love. It is waiting for you. Find what? No more waiting. Please, can't you just let me die? I can't take any more. Tanya? Go. Die. Fade. Portal. Oof. Tatiana, are you still there? Boris, help! Die, Igor! Uh-oh. I don't understand. Oh, fuck! Reactor, Chernobyl light. Well, what do I do? Oh, fuck, I need to figure this out! You. Alright, we're fighting the Black Stalker then, I guess. That's what I'm thinking, at least. Can you need this? No. Hello. You took your time, Igor. Cut the crap. It's time you gave me some answers. Yes, we'll get to that. But since this is our last meeting, I want to ask you a question first. Fine. Just make it quick. What do you really hope to achieve, Igor? I have no idea. Survival would be a start. Huh. You may find this surprising, but our goals are actually aligned. How's that? We were both going after the same thing, but this whole time we've been chasing someone else's agenda without knowing it. Chernobylite's agenda. Wait, what? Come on, man. I've come too far to be fed a line of bullshit. Let's start from the beginning. Do you know who I am? Ooh, speculate you're the same person. You're a future version of me, and you keep coming back to stop me from making a mistake. That's partially correct, but not in the way you think. Hmm. The more important question the question you somehow failed to ask yourself all this time is, who are you? Because you're not Professor Igor Kiminyuk. You never were. I oh. am Igor Kiminyuk. I only changed my name to protect you and your mother. Protect me? How? By trying to kill me at every turn? So who am I? If I wanted to kill you, I would have done it the first time we met at the power plant. Will you quit talking in fucking riddles? The truth is hard to swallow, I know. It was hard for me, too. You are me. Tachana isn't your fiance. She's mine. Everything you know about her, everything you remember, Damn. none of it is yours. You're living someone else's life. My life. You are my clone, sort of. You got my body, my brain, my skills, and most importantly, my memories from before the Chernobyl disaster. What are you saying? How is that even possible? Tatiana was sterile. That was our personal tragedy. But when Semenov imprisoned her after the Duga fiasco, she fell pregnant. At first, I thought Boris was the father, and I was angry with her. 
but that was another of Semenov's lies. He needed me to stay on the project and study Chernobylite, so he injected Tanya with the nano solution. What happened next was, I don't know what to call it, an immaculate conception. Damn. She gave birth to a boy, you. You grew much more quickly than other kids, but your mind didn't seem to follow. It was different somehow. Wait, what? The Chernobylite no doubt affected you in unpredictable ways. I never really considered you my son. You scared the shit out of me. I didn't know what to do with you. But it was obvious that Semenov would incorporate you into his experiments. Or maybe cut you open and rummage around inside. Until one night, Tanya, your mother, communicated with me telepathically, even though her body was in a coma. She pleaded with me to release you into the woods. And that's what I did. You're saying Tatiana's child, who you released in the woods in 1990, but that's impossible. Impossible. I don't remember any of this. Of course you don't. You looked like a teenager and had the mind of a small child. I remember giving you a sweater that Tatiana knitted for me. The night was so cold. It had my name on it. The sweater? I had it in the camp. I was imprisoned and... Yes, it could have been a trigger. Your mind somehow began to rebuild itself. Why in my image? I can only guess. Perhaps you were constructed from Tatiana's desires. From Jesus Christ, what the heck is this? Child. What do you mean, GG? It's not GG. I called it pseudoscience. I suspect the process was somehow facilitated by the Chernobylite. But she's been calling me this whole time. She wanted me here. I'm afraid you were bamboozled, my poor boy. We all were. It wasn't Tanya who called you here, but it. Chernobylite? But the images, the voices, they felt so real, I know. Your mother was your biggest weakness, and the entity exploited that. Ooh. It wanted you here. It has plans for you, you see, and I cannot allow it to succeed. Someone sent me a photo of Tatiana and the piece of Chernobylite. Those weren't hallucinations. They were real. I couldn't have constructed my portal gun without them. Oh, that... It was that bastard Semenov, of course. He wanted to bring you here as well. He never got over it when you vanished. Not that it matters now. I really hoped you would stay away. But it's too late now. I can't allow you to interact yeah, so with the I entity okay. in any way. Only one of us is leaving this room alive. Wait, can't we talk it over? Huh. We just did. Goodbye, son. Igor. I wish there was another way. Bop, bop, bop. Whoa, what? That's not fun. Three against one, dude. 10k HP, okay. Are you kidding me? Molecular battery. Uh, give me you. But that's not it. Oh, no, it's not. Ay, ay, ay. Alright, uh. Phase one, even. I wish there was another way. He's gonna use some BS gun then. Wow. Wow. And he really is crazy on me. I won't do the same for you. Sixteen fifteen shells only. I won't let you hurt her. Gives me no pleasure, but it has to be done. Come on, show me the new and improved Igor Kimenyuk. Give up already. I promise to make it quick for Tachana's. 
You're making this too easy, son. Oh shoot, I have no boats. Uh you Uh, let's see. At least I thought of damage. Could be his HP. Okay, bit by the face too. Okay. Oh shoot. Don't leave, don't leave, don't... Oh! Boy, that does no damage. Okay, halfway, 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 halfway. Already, I promise to make it quick for Tachana's sake. Let's find some slugs. Forty two to go. Yeah. Shot and slug. Oh, oh, yes. This gives me no pleasure. Ow, ow, ow. Ow, 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 What do you mean too easy? I'm doing pretty good, I guess. I wish there was another way. I have my psyche, alcohol. Ah! Yeah, yeah. Give up already. I promise to make it quick for Tachana's sake. You're making this too easy, son. Give up already. I promise to make it quick for Tachana's sake. Just give me slugs. Don't ask for more. Just slugs. You're making this too easy, son. Give up already. Two seven. I promise to make it quick for Tachana's sake. Okay. He's at zero, so what now? Oh! Shoot! He coming. He coming, dude. Oh, uh, Salvi. Should I shoot? Yeah, that's obviously doesn't help. Ow. Come on, open. Whoa! Damn. Get up. <laughs> I don't need a force field to defeat you. Oh! What? You... What the heck? You should be dead. Yeah, I've been getting that a lot lately. Look familiar? Yes. Where did you get that from? 
Where else? I took it from you. From your cold, dead hands, Igor. Wait, what? I... What? Where? When? In a reality where you fucked up, my friend. From oh. one of the many worlds bearing the brunt of your failures. Are you saying that you come from a different... That you're from... <sighs> this is hell. You have no idea. Where are you going? Back to my screwed up world, of course. You know me. I'd prefer to die fighting. Wait! Don't waste the chance I've given you, Igor. Finish the job. Okay. Give me slugs then, still. Still need slugs. It's over, my son. Close the portal. Cut the connection. Deny this thing away into our world. Do it now. Son, please. It will kill her. It will kill the love of my life. Of our life. Please. There's another way. Just let me go. I've suffered long enough. This is confusing a little. You can be the man I could not. Be the better version of me. Go through the portal and face this thing. Undo the harm we both caused Tanya. No. Do not do this. Kill me. Just kill me, please. Finish it. Destroy it. It's yes. time to end this once and for all. If anyone can hear me, run as far from here as you can. Everyone, run like hell. Right, run away, run away, run away, run away, run away, run away. I have no idea what it just did. Except for destroying the place. Run, 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 run. We should meet someone up now. We're boom. Thank you for showing me the way. I won't waste this, I promise. Goodbye. You can rest now. The protagonist never explained to his comrades exactly what happened at the power plant, but he came out changed. Protagonist, yeesh. The Chernobylite vanished entirely. The zone is now free of it. What about Semenov, damn it? Igor Stalkers drove off the remaining NAR troops and even convinced a few of them to join the cause. Okay. Oh, it's the multiple enemies. Now they're working together for the good of the sandwich shells, tracking down the few remaining monsters still roaming the area. Olivier never had the chance to change his own past and prevent the ambush that wiped out his team. Oof. His obsession almost steered him down the dark path of treachery, but in the end, he redeemed himself by helping Igor with his mission. Even though it cost him his life, because he had been a part of something bigger than himself, he was at peace in his final moments. In spite of his flaws, Olivier will always be remembered in the zone for his courage and grit. <laughs> oh, damn it. For this haunted place will always be a monument to broken heroes with a twisted past. Mikhail's life was always full of violence. But he was the angriest, most obnoxious man Igor had ever known. But he was also unfailingly honest, both with himself and others. Mikhail's thirst to avenge his murdered friends That's was a virtue, his main guess, driving right? force. But working with Igor and the others eventually made him appreciate the kinder aspects of life. In spite of his rough manner and the darkness inside him, Igor came to like the neurotic stalker and by the end considered him a true colleague. Didn't die, so that's good. Mikhail decided to remain in the zone and join the others in protecting their shared home. Sashko had always been the lone wolf and daredevil of the zone. 
Life had always been harsh for him, and he learned the hard way to rely only on himself. His crusade Shame against NAR mm -hmm. began with a desire for closure regarding his brother Ruslan's death. But Igor's quest to find Tatiana was what kept him going until the end. In his final moments, he enjoyed a privilege afforded to few men indeed. He had no regrets. That's good at least, I guess. He died as he lived, fighting bravely for those closest to him. And that was enough. Tadakon's fight against the Rat King has reached an end. Having barely survived the zone, he realized his time was up. Hey, Eddie, now, thanks for the sub. Else must carry the torch uh, how's the game? The well, uh, I think I finished it. The ending is confusing as fuck. But Tadakon wasn't worried. After all, he had prepared Igor and others well. Worth a few bucks? Yes. I do have the key. Tadakan's true wanted. identity was never discovered. Was he a madman? A saint? A spy? Perhaps he was all of these. Or perhaps none of them. But one thing is certain. The old man was a true uh, child of the Yep. yep. His yep, restless yep, 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 soul yep, 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 yep. will forever wander its marshes and woods. Like so many before him, General Koslov made the wrong choices while chasing a dream of the good life. War taught him about the cruelty and inevitability of loss. I mean, there was uh, him one part where I could just change stuff, but it never came again, so... His experiences made him strong, but also blind to the serendipitous moments which could have placed his life on a different trajectory. And so his death was I guess I'll be able to life. change stuff General now Kostov after the game. spent his final moments consumed with bitterness. If I only had another chance, he said to himself. Alas, that is a privilege afforded to very few. Mumbo Jumbo just like Mr. Streamer. Yep. The key the got got nothing else to play anyway. Yeah, okay, okay. Almost got him killed. Will do. He was a brilliant scientist, but could never come to Text terms though, with so the collapse I'll of the Soviet Union. The Though not a devout communist, Semenov could not stomach the chaotic aftermath, for it reflected the emptiness of his own heart. And so he chased his green chair nobleite dream. Hoping his experiments would usher in a new world order. Try pop. <laughs> in reality, <laughs> what he sought was to fill the Probably gaping did. void in his own <laughs> soul. Meeting his former student Igor saved Semenov's life, although he could never have predicted it. Confronted with mortal danger, he realized he could no longer allow his demons to determine his fate. He left the zone, hoping there was still time for him to find oh, peace. Oh, he left it. Okay. Without Semenov's brilliance, NAR eventually dissolved. Most of its mercenaries wiped out by either the Shadows or the Samos Shields. Faced with staggering losses, the shareholders halted all funding. All that remains of NAR in the zone are the empty barracks and derelict labs, stark reminders of a misguided ambition based on human misery. Oof. Which one of the game endings? Well, we did it. Hold to return to main menu. Hold. New difficulty mode has been unlocked. You can choose Gate of Madness difficulty when starting a new game for the ultimate challenge. One save only. If you don't have enough Chernobyl at the moment of your death, you will die permanently. Ooh, no more recovering weapons from soldier bodies. Well, that never came to. If you sleep at the base, your radiation level will somewhat increase. Ooh, the rest of resources and levels. Yikes. What's next on the list? Uh, Dead Space 3. Uh, if, uh, you add madness. It will permanently lower your psyche level. How fun. Oof. Base is damaged and started with negative statistics. Yikes. Companions have lower morality at the beginning of the game. Gardens are disabled. Yikes. Get out of this. Oh boy. I guess that's it. Done with the game, I guess. 
So I can't actually do some time travel stuff. Events, yes, yeah. Alright then, uh, thanks for coming, thanks for watching, thanks for the sub uh, and the bits. And when's the chili pepper tassel challenge? Well, probably never. <laughs> Not that desperate yet, eh? Alright, thanks for coming. We'll see you tomorrow with Dead Space 3. I heard that's crap as well, so why not? Might as well, right? Alright, see ya. Enjoy the last song.